welcome back. Today I'm going to be looking at uh, upgrading my station, the Mushroom HQ. Um, it's long in need of some upgrades. Like I say, I've had this now for since I started playing. It's like the first station I built, and it's too small now for my needs. So what I'm going to be doing is uh, do a quick speed build on upgrading it. I'm going to expand it um, in both directions where the main doors are. And I'm going to uh, completely gut the lab as well. I'm going to get rid of all this because this is like stage one factories. They don't even do factories like this anymore. <laughs> um, and then after that, um, I'm probably going to build, build the weapons lab on the side corner. So uh, that's the plan. I've moved the uh, faction block and the build block a couple of times. I'm probably going to move them again. But uh, let's get started. So first, I'm going to start off by taking off this back wall. Um, like I say, you've got to raise in 10 by 10 so it takes a while. We're working in 8x eight, eight times speed right now. So, uh, like I say, yeah, I kept on removing the build block, I kept deleting myself, you know. So anyway, we remove all of this, get the walls gone, move to the other end, start moving this. And there's something I forgot here, I should have closed all the doors before I started, because as soon as you uh, start working they're invisible so you've got to get out and try and find out where they are and close them which is something i ended up having to do here so here we are there we go go to the other door open it <laughs> so yeah there we go right now we can remove the doors so started removing those didn't take too long um, like I say, right now I'm just trying to get the ends nice and clean so I can extend the walls out. I've got a good idea for the design I want to use, but um, I need a clean area to work with, so I'm going to get rid of all this. There we go, nearly done. And fix all the bits that I took off by accident. And now we can get started. So I put the symmetry on in the same place, basically, as. Uh, where it was when I originally built it. There we go. Now we can start working on the walls. So we're going to go with 10, you know, slabs of 10. I'm just going to work out, expanding it outwards like a funnel. Every 10. I'm going to bring this really far back, about four times its current length. And just keep on working that back. Nice purple stripe. And the symmetry will mean there's two of them, which is nice. So we just keep on moving, making this side wall, and obviously I want this to be like my uh, a hangar which I can fit large ships in. So you know we're going to make it really big. So it could be bigger, but we don't want to lag everyone out just by loading it up. So I'm doing like a staggered design here. Um, so it sort of funnels in a you know it'll be narrower in the middle and wider at the corners. Just sort of it'd be a nice nice little effect when it's finished. Um, had to put a little bit in there to build off because I'm uh, lazy and uh, afterwards I'll clean it all up so like I say we're nearly finished with the walls now I think yeah yeah the walls are done so I just got to fill in any gaps which I missed a few bits here and there there we go that's pretty much it right so now I got to make the ceiling and the, the, the roof it's going to be the same it's going to expand out but I'm going to use a slightly different pattern so that it's fresh. I don't want it to look exactly the same. Okay, and then we're just going to work this back. This is going to take a while. I remember this took ages. <laughs> um, the total for all of this which you're watching is an hour. So this this segment that you're watching now took me an hour. Um, off we go. And boom! Looks like I skipped a lot. <laughs> now we're at the end. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to do the uh, other end, so yeah, that's what I've ended up with. Uh, I'll, I'll do another, I'll show you that again when I've finished this end. So I'm just moving the symmetry point, and then we're going to build another one. This one isn't going to be expanding out, it's just going to be straight, because I've got a plan to build off the side of this. Okay, so, I think that's, yeah, that's far enough. I thought about having it flare out at the end there, but then I decided not to. So um, there we go. Now I've got to make the top. So just expand that out. Doesn't take very long. 
do do do. Right, nearly done. Brilliant. Right, now, put a new door in. And I'm going to do something funny with the pattern on this door. I did get into making the doors. I don't know why. I, <laughs> I got into making a pattern with these doors. Um, it's because I'd just done the other door. You didn't really see it because I skipped it. But uh, I just got into the idea of making these chunky vault style door design. <laughs> it takes ages to open and close, but it looks pretty cool. <laughs> So yeah, I'm just doing the detail on this vault door. This isn't as good as the one at the other end, I don't think, but I was just playing around. Because I did the whole of this freehand, really. There's no, like, I did have a sort of plan on the back of a napkin, but it wasn't really, like, uh, detailed or anything. <laughs> so, there we go. Just putting in a bit more detail so it looks a little bit, yeah, I think I just, I changed that. I was like, nah, yeah, do it like that. Yeah. I'll wait until I pan out because it's sort of like you can't really tell what I'm doing. Just putting in loads of little uh, features into the door. It's quite trippy. <laughs> Here we go. So, messing around with various different patterns and then putting it back. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I spent ages on the doors <laughs> saying that. Um, but then that's what people see when they're closed, so I figure it's nicer than just a big flat thing. Um, oh yeah, I made a dock for ships, but uh, that's not finished yet. Uh, here we go, I'll go around patching up a few holes. Make it look nice. There's all these bits I've just missed everywhere. Little holes, just fixing it up. Oh yeah, that's right, and then there were a few bits that were sticking out, so I decided to even that out, fill the holes in, so it's nice and smooth, still not completely finished, but you know, when it's this big, you know, is there any point in putting loads of wedges in, I mean, it's huge, you know, I don't know, let me know, tell me in the comments if you think I should put wedges on it, I kind of like the ribbed look, ah, here we go, now we get to look at this door, see, that's nice, I, I like this door better, thanks for watching, see you next time.